I realized that there was a real need to um, really just start having these tough conversations and start mm-hmm. talking about um, mm-hmm. start talking about the elephant in the room is what I called it. People who already know CS teach their kids CS, so then people who don't have that exposure can't break into the field. When I had somebody that was like, I've been there, I can help you, how that literally changed my life, right? Hopefully we can all have a growth mindset and the best way I can do that is to have it myself. What could I actually do in the world? How can I change the world? And so that naturally sort of leads to technology. And it's just lifting this one tool, not the context, but the tool itself. When it finally worked, it was probably the best feeling ever because I had worked so hard on it. A year after, it was not allowed, yet not not allowed. Kind of a gray area. It was a super gray area. At the time. <laughs> outcome could be really positive, or it could be, you know, hacking into something that you know you probably shouldn't be doing, but you learn a lot along the way. I go back to something my colleague at the business school says often, which is, you know, do good, do well. And the message is, if you're doing something good out there that actually helps people, then you will do well. Mm. But if you go into it with the, you know, I want to make money, it's not so clear that what you'll build yeah. will actually do good.